Morning sports fans, Heidi hi. Now then, this morning I'm gonna to talk to you about these like rad looking Sun God Vulcans. I've just climbed up and it's very hot today. It's like the hottest day of the year. Uh, I've just climbed up the Beast of Burden, which is the uh, pedal up climb at Bike Park, Wales. And it's a good kind of 20, 25 minute climb. Uh, and as you can see, I'm a bit sweaty, a bit sweaty. Cool, look at me here. I'm going for that lockdown look again, aren't I? Rad. Uh, look at my beautiful bike in the background there. Whoa, the Pink Panther, that's rad as well. That's why my glasses are pink, they had to match the bike, because I'm an all soul. Uh, yeah, Sun God Vulcans, right, I'm colorblind to give you a bit of background, and my colour blindness is quite bad. So I have to wear sunglasses a lot. I wear them most of the time for driving, uh, pretty much always for cycling. Uh, and any time the light gets dappled in the wood, I can't see anything, I'm just a passenger, regardless of, even if I'd got infrared X-ray specs, it wouldn't make any difference. Uh, so, and I've used Oakley's for years, and Oakley's are excellent, and particularly their prism lenses. They've got a, I'm red green colour blind and they've got like a red tint and I think they're polarised and they're really good you know but I, I've felt over the last few years that phew, it's a bit of its build quality has gone at Oakley it's not they're not quite as good as they used to be and I've owned a lot of pairs of Oakley's probably 10 or 12 I don't know but I, I can't wear cheap glasses because I have to wear them every day and I have to wear them all the time and so I need to buy quality lenses and so these I came across these quite by accident actually Sun God I'd kind of heard of the brand um, but they did a, a, sh uh, a crowdfunded on Crowdcube last year and I got quite interested in them because they were you know a British brand or well, I think they're based in Switzerland actually but something like that or one of the shops is um, and uh, you know they have a really strong ethical and social stance which really appeals to me as a, uh, as a human being, as an earthling and as a consumer. Let's move that down a bit, my arm's aching. Can you still see the pink panther? Uh, <laughs> I'm an arsehole. Uh, uh, yeah, and so I, I ended up buying a few shares and as a consequence of that, I actually got a, I got, actually got them free. Although they weren't free really at all, obviously. They cost me a lot more than they would have done just to buy a pair. Uh, however, that's a, you know, a long-term investment towards my pension plan. And it wasn't that much money. I'm not a millionaire. Uh, I'm just an ordinary working bloke. Uh, and so I think they retail, these Vulcans retail at about, I think they're about 150 quid. I really should know this, shouldn't I? Uh, if I'm doing a review. Yeah. So my point about coming up Beast of Burden was that they haven't fogged at all. And I was hot, sweaty, got my helmet on, uh, nothing. Crystal clear, which is marvellous. Uh, the lens quality, I've only had them for about three or four months. The lens quality is fabulous. The crystal clear really helps with my trail vision which is really quite necessary uh, because I don't see the same definition that other people see by any means. I've figured out. Um, and also, they do loads of different colours as well. I selected one particularly towards my colour vision, if I'm honest, to, to make it better, not just for, like, you know, shiny posing. Uh, but what they also do, obviously, which is rad, and you can see, is my wicked pink frame to match my bike, is that they do all, all the frames custom, so you can build your, your full frame in the same colour, you can have half frames, different colours, different, you know, I think there's some kind of, uh, well, I've lost, I've lost one already, but there's these little logos on the side, you can have those different colours, you can have your, you know, ear socks, different colours, a lot really, it's pretty cool, man. Um, yeah, they're fully customisable, so, and you can buy extra lenses and all the rest of it, and they come in a, you know, a really nice box with a really nice cleaning cloth and, and all the rest of it. And I've got to say that, really, all, all I've really come to do is tell you that how impressed I am with them so far. I think they're just amazing. They, they, you know, people look at the modern cycling sunglasses and go, oh, they're massive, but, you know, we're wearing goggles most of the time, and it's no different to wearing a pair of, you know, Smith goggles or whatever. 
uh, you know, I get really good coverage, you're not getting bugs in your eyes or anything. I can get, you know, I'm, I think I've got the longer nose bridges attached. They come with like three different nose bridge attachments to set them out differently on your face. Um, I think, I'm, I don't know which one, I think I've got the long ones on because it means I get the airflow underneath when I'm on trail going downhill and stuff and it keeps them clear. So yeah, my conclusion really is that they're worth looking at. If you, uh, oh, and they do a lifetime warranty as well, lifetime replacement warranty on stuff. So uh, Oakley used to do that. Uh, years ago and I think as they got bigger they realised it probably wasn't sustainable uh, and stopped doing it I think you get like 12 months on a pair of Oakley's now but currently Sun God are offering lifetime warranty and so that's worth grabbing you know so if you crash and smash your glasses you just get a new pair um, I would imagine as they grow as a company and I think they're doing very well they are doing very well as a company um, as they grow and get bigger they'll probably ditch the the lifetime warranty just like Oakley did so it's worth grabbing it while you've got it because um, I would imagine if you buy a pair that that'll get honoured even if they stop doing it it'll be for future purchases so um, yeah worth worth a look at uh, I think it's sungod.com not sure I'll put a link at the bottom so you can have a look and see um, uh, yeah, they do some cool lifestyle glasses, Renegades and Sierras. I've got a pair of one, one pair of one of them that are really nice, nice for driving in, like a red tinted lens. So, uh, yeah, check them out. Sungod.com. I've been Neil Cotton. You've been fabulous. ChaseTheRainbow.co.uk. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification button.